Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to some more Apex Legends. In this video, I had some people ask me what uh what are my settings, especially ever since I swapped to PC. So I figured I'd do a season 15 setting breakdown. It'd be a shorter video. We're just gonna kind of cover some of the highlights. Uh, first thing is map rotation on. That weapon auto cycle on empty. I cut that off. It's got me killed a bunch of times. Auto sprint. I always use auto sprint on. And you'll find that close range engagements, I don't know, I kind of like it. You, you can slide and get away without having to click down. Just as soon as you push forward, you just go. I like that. I don't run anonymous mode because no one cares who I am. Uh, For my critical. I just go with good enough works for me. Don't use mouse and key for the roller. And when I used to play on a like the standard, I guess, classic, whatever. I would run this right here, 4-4, four, four, classic, and small movement dead zone. But now I'm on ALC set. And this is what I've been running all season 15 and most of season 14. And I don't know, it, just, it feels so smooth. No dead zone, 1% out of threshold. Finds curve is right up under a uh, classic. A 10, that'd be considered like a classic response curve. I run one under, and yes, it does, can... Feel the difference. Y'all speed's 310, same as pitch. The reason I run both of those the same is imagine if like one was lower than the other instead of coming up like this. Instead of being just a straight line as you move, it would be more of like a curve, kind of like that. And I don't want that. I want whatever direction I push, that's which way it goes. It's the same speed. This, once it hits the outer threshold, you get a little extra. So... In case you need to turn real quick, you max out your joystick, you get a little extra right there. That's what I that's what that does. And my ADS, 220. ADS pitch and y'all are both 220. Extra turning y'all is 90. This right here, the higher you have this, it makes it easier to control the recoil, but also harder to aim. So it's kind of a trade-off. And you could probably bump this up even higher as long as you bump this up. Makes it Make sure your thumbstick a bit stiffer. That way you won't uh, overshoot your targets. This right here with this current setup, instead of having to really pull down on the joystick, I swear, all you have to do is just lightly rest your thumb on the joystick. And that's enough to control the recoil. Especially with no dead zone. Like every every little input, like it, it picks it up. And for this right here, what I recommend is, again, it's only for controller. But... Find the spot to where you do not have stick drift. Let's say you're on eight and it's not moving. Bump it down to maybe five or six, not moving. Bump it down to three and your like your cursor starts doing this right here or like that. And bump it up just a little bit if it's a wild drift. You, I don't know. You kind of want a little bit of stick drift, but not too much. That's how I look at it. You want it so as soon as you touch your thumbstick, the input is instantaneous. Instantly register. And of course, we run aim assist and aim assist on. And as far as video, playing 1440p, 104 FOV, and I have a 3080, 12, 12 gig, 3080. I just, I normally just keep everything low. V sync uh, disabled, reflex disabled. I have my FPS set on my, my GPU. I just got it capped at 150, even though it's 100. And, 65 hertz monitor. I just capped it at 150 just so the stream would be stable. And to everything, I run four, four uh, gigabytes for that. By linear, disabled. Again, low on most of this stuff, disabled. Audio, 100% master volume. Push to talk. I can, like I said, I play on controller, but I can always reach over and just hold T. Uh, don't worry, messing up that sound effects. There. Dialogue volume because I found that the characters talk way too much. Sit down. Also, I thought I cut this off. I've noticed that some games, I don't know if Apex is one of them, but some games, the, the music that plays in the background or in the lobby has it's copyright. It's copyright protected, so it's good. I always cut the music off. Anyway, that's my season 15 settings. Uh, looking for something new? Try them out. Let me know what you think about them. And as always, peace out. Y'all have a good one.